いよいよ今日ね夜がとっても楽しみだわ Hi, my name is Vitamin D Stain and welcome back to some King Koi. I literally just got back from work and it was very, very hot today. I feel a little out of it. Anyways, let's get straight to this video. Yeah, keep your expectations high. Shilby, Sama, Tabesing, you like him, I say, yo. Josh, you know, high, I don't know. She's so annoying. God. She's such a Karen, but with humongous jugs. Just leave! It comes with that functionality? Oh, it's a she. Okay. Freeze drying function? It really could do anything, couldn't it? So the religious scientific capabilities were fearsome indeed. What around seven work? We ought to be awake if we hold off until then. I'll just put this out there, but don't make her do anything too unreasonable. I see. <sighs> Please tell me I'm not the only one that gets annoyed with this woman. I cannot be the only one that's gotten annoyed with her. I just nag, 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 nag. Right? Right? Are you some Osaka lady or something? Who knows? I sure don't. There are apparently old ladies in Osaka who hand out candy whenever they're given a chance. And they have purple hair. I bet it's about as outlandish as you think. It sounded like everyone was looking forward to it. And the same went for me. I don't know about freaking Neller. I wonder if Mina chan will be there. Hmm. I forgot it's her root. Whoops. <laughs> Have to? No, you don't. I had taken yesterday off, spur of the moment. It would be one thing if it were only for an etiquette lesson, but I had been invited to his room for a party today. I was not feeling especially confident. I could even look him in the eye, but... There was only an hour left until the proposed meetup time. I could move freely right now and his room was just across the hall, so I should just ask him. However, I couldn't imagine visiting a gentleman's room without some important reason. <laughs> I need to take action if I wanted to confirm how I felt about him after all. Oh, you guys know my nose tampon? So, I was about to use it once. Good, no one talked over me. Great. Um, I was about to use it. I had uncapped it. I was about to, and then drop it. And it rolls, and it rolls, and it rolls all over the floor. And I'm like... Yeah, I'm not, I'm not using this anymore. Ain't no way you could sanitize it. Right? Anyways, I threw it away. I'm now nose tampon less, unfortunately. So, I'll, I guess I'll just die when I record. I guess everything's more or less ready to go. All that was left was to heat up some water and get the microwave going full tilt once Raina got here. I'm sure Sylvie will show up with Edison and I assume I'll have to go get Rhea. That just left 
the girl I wanted to see most. Since we were in different school years, I didn't get many chances to see Mina-chan in the afternoon. I wonder if she'll be here today. I'd never been so anxious before, and the part of me was a little afraid. She hasn't really given me an answer yet, either. There was no guarantee that she would accept my feelings. If anything, I thought my profession of love could be called ill-advised. Hmm? For whatever reason, I felt like I was being watched. And when I turned around to check... <laughs> Ill? What was that just now? It was almost like someone was outside. That distinctive hair. It had to be Mina-chan. She really sucked at hiding and I would occasionally catch quick glimpses of her. Did she come to check up on me? I had no idea what she was after, but I may as well join in this game of hide and seek for a minute. Must be my imagination. I didn't get much sleep after all. I will leave it at that. I had said as much at a semi-loud volume so that she could hear me, but I wondered how it had gone. Bro, she's weird. She's watching me like crazy. Those eyes stuck into my back once again. She'd apparently come to the conclusion that I hadn't noticed. <sighs> Mina-chan's still not here, huh? A teensy practical joke sprung to my mind. <laughs> Though the sound was faint, Mina-chan had gasped. Considered this sounded effective, I decided to keep it up. I wonder what Mina-chan is up to. I hope I get to see her soon. Oh, it was working, it was working. Wait, this was stupidly embarrassing for me too. But, as if I'll back down now. A pointlessly extreme battle of wills had begun. Which of us would give up first? Oh, I didn't get to see Mina-chan yesterday, and there's so much I want to talk to her about. This part was true, so every word came out smoothly. Whether or not I could talk to her face to face aside. I wonder if Mina-chan will give me her answer. It'd be awful to rush her, so I guess I'll wait patiently. <laughs> what are you doing, Mina? Get out of there, dude. Alright, better hit up the bathroom before everyone gets here. <laughs> sure, as I was that she was trying to hide, I could still see her. I doubt Mina-chan had ever played hide and seek. On second thought, no real need. I don't want to go yet anyway. I tossed in a mild faint. Faint. Oh, she hadn't fallen for it? Better drag it out a while longer, then give the faint a try. Maybe I'll go grab a drink? <laughs> On second thought, never mind. Actually, I really should get something to drink. <laughs> she was totally panicking. Okay, this is kind of fun. Hmm. Nah, I guess I'm good. Just kidding. <coughs> Mina-chan, what are you doing? <coughs> she slunk back on me. What was this? How cute. <coughs> That's fine, but you're not going to at least make an appearance? What happened yesterday? Restless and catching glances, I'd never seen Minachan so out of sorts before. Just an issue of timing. Also, come in a little more quietly. She wasn't even a little ashamed. I'm done for the most part. All that left is to boil the water and throwing some stuff into the microwave. Totally. Oh, I'd better get out the disposable chopsticks to go with it. Don't worry about it. You can take a seat. So we know the sun should be here soon, too. Great. Sylvia-sama and Anagi-chan. 
おしゃれなご飯もいいけど、やっぱこの味だよね。ガレンちゃん。We got ガレンちゃん and Sylvia さま coming soon. Where the frick is my water? I have a question for you guys. What do you think fits Ella better? Nagi chan or Karen chan? I think Nagi chan is pretty good too. Let me know in the comment section below. Mane o s t e m i m a s t a n g Oto tatete susuru to you know, Nakanaka ni muzukashi d e s n Close your eyes, rewind the video 20 seconds, and just let your imagination go. Nande m i n a oto tatete s u s u t e n o r a n d a said it was more fun to eat that way. <laughs> huh? We have no idea what you're saying. And come on, don't talk with your mouth full. I mean, it's not like I don't understand the sensibilities of commoners. That was a good slurp. どうやら私にはいささか難易度が高かったようなのでおあらら残念たかあ俺これ食ったことねえよもらっていい ?No! Sure, eat whatever you like あ俺はすすらねえからなチェー Everyone was seated around the table together eating ramen And that puny table behind Ellie? That's a rice burger. They're delicious. You're in heavily toward eating frozen food on a rotation, huh? Really? Jogosaki had to be looking out for her. How are you not dead yet? Look, don't get me wrong, I obviously don't want her to die, and I would be paying. Pained to see her die again, but it's just it seems like she's not sick at all, you know. Like, we haven't even seen any signs, you know, there has been no collapses, and it's already February in this timeline. So, it's like, shouldn't you wait a minute? Well, I guess no, it makes sense because. Okay, apparently this game, I finally found out. I didn't talk about this last video that I uploaded because I completely forgot, but here's some King Koi lore. So, according to one of the viewers, Kroya, thank you so much if you're watching. I appreciate it. This person seems to be knowledgeable, so I'm like, okay, I'm not going to question it, but I did find it interesting. This person said, Kroya said, that this game is an alternate timeline to of the original story. Meaning, let's just say it's like, it's the first year 2.0. In other words, is what I'm trying to say. So it actually does make sense that Rhea is still alive because she survived the first year and after Christmas, going to the second year, she was getting really sick. But again, it just feels weird after seeing her pass away and crying about it on camera. And now she's like back like nothing and like symptom free as of now. Except now everybody knows about the disease or. The condition, but still, it's it's a little weird. Oh, and there's like a theory about why Sylvia was crying when they were all together in the rooftop, the three of them, Rhea, Odo, and herself. So, here's what I heard supposedly, somehow, Sylvia for some reason remembered what happened in the last game, in the end of the last game, which is where Rhea died. And supposedly, in this timeline, somehow, Sylvia remembered that. When they were up there watching the sunset. Because if you guys also remember, at the end of the game, after Rhea had died and Sylvia and Oda were at the top and she had cut her hair, they were watching the sunset. People are theorizing that supposedly she had remembered that specific event or 
the aftermath of Rio's death and she, that's why she had shed a tear. I have no idea how real it is. It's a theory. But also, once again, I thought it was really interesting. So, Korea, thank you for the information. I really do appreciate it. And if you guys know any other theories or have anything else to add to what Korea said or something completely different, please do let me know. I would like to hear about it on social media or on the comment section. Social media, I have them under the video description. So, please take a look there and let me know if you have anything else to add. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, not only do you have tumors, but you smoke and you eat instant food all the time. Man, Rio's. Man, Reyna's a savage. <laughs> Should we listen to that again? No? We're gonna listen to it again. Nice. You got it. Which do you want? Matcha style seafood flavor? What? That sounds terrible. Matcha? Huh? You're seriously going to eat this? If you say so. I waited a bit after pouring in the hot water to hand it to Sylvie. I think having it a little al dente makes for a better mouthfeel. If you're the type who waits three minutes, then two minutes is best for me, personally. そうそう。カレーヌードルにチーズ入れてみたりね。それは美味しそうですね。エルチンやってみる私チーズ買っといたからチーズマシマシカレーヌードルできちゃうよ。え、ぜひお願いします。俺は何食おうかな。たまには
カップ麺にマナーなんてないと思うよドレスコードありのレストランでカップ麺食べたりしないっしょそそれとこれとは Speaking from a commerce perspective, it's pretty ordinary to slurp your noodles. ほらほら、オーロもこう言ってるんだからさ。というわけでカミニャン、豪快に行ってみようお,お姉さま。みんな、やってみましょう。ラーメンはね、音を立てて食べた方が実際美味しいのよ。Is that right? 体感的に !With feeling! こんな感じよ。That's all right now. No, that's freaking Karen Chan over here. Look at him. I'm going to go to the next one. 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 There we go. Fire was lit. Under Mina chan's butt, and it seemed to ignite her competitive nature. Oh, it's delicious. When I go to Japan and I have noodles, no one's gonna make me slurp. My, my, my sopa, however, I will. I get the foreigner pass, so I'm sure it'll be okay. Hopefully, I think. Oh, that's another reason why I don't want to do it. I'll start choking on the water, I'll start choking on the noodle, everything, and I, I'm not trying to embarrass myself. That's crazy to say. Right? Her small size really gives that sort of impression. This one was more of a carnivore, a light eater, though. Why was the other petite girl so different from Rhea? Because Rhea is always spicy. Ah,確かに美味しいとは思いますけど、味が濃すぎますわ。それが癖になるのや。神にゃん、神にゃん、私のと一口交換しよう。こっちもなかなかいけるよ。Pig out, everyone. Sama can get it all so clean that get a sick at the dinner. Not to go on going. Daro. I like to say that when I absolutely eat more than I should. You know, I pigged out. <laughs> it's so funny. <laughs> Pigging out. Pigging out is crazy. But it's it's really true because like you feel like a piggy after you eat. You're like, ah, I ate too much. I'm full. Literally pigging out, especially when it's junk food. Oh my God. But it's just, it's good. It's good. I try to avoid it, you know, but there's the cheat days. I give myself two cheat days max. Occasionally three, but that's like not often, you know what I mean? Meto食品やカップ麺で国品と会食しまらない家ですわね。たまに楽しむのが性に合っているみたいね。非常食として優秀なことには間違いありません。持ち帰れば分の食料事情に一石を投じそうですね。一番気に入ってるじゃねえか
The princess's iron stomachs were fearsome indeed. I'd love to suggest an after dinner tea, but I don't really have anything fancy like that. Pull it out of Kiro's butt, yeah. Oh no. Eating late too is a big fat no no too. Oh my gosh. シルビー様、そろそろお休みの時間ですよ。あんだけ食べてすぐ寝てこのプロポーション。本当シルビーの体ってどうなってんだろう。最上級のマッサージやエステなどの効果もありますが、大きくは5本人の体質であるとしか。
あ、いや。あ、それでレジにいた時も実質に殿方を立ち入らせたことはありませんもの。あ、おう。リリ。ええ。ですから、ここにあなたを招き入れたことは、お姉様にも秘密ですわよ。あ、おう。うん、ガリ
We still have 10 minutes. Otherwise, that would have been a good spot to end it. To avoid cliffhangers, of course. Well, I guess it kind of is, but not a major cliffhanger, I feel. It was the day after the party. I had quickly given up on trying to settle things on my own and decided to ask for help. Hey, Reyna. I need to talk to you for a second. Is this a good time? Thank you. Tons of people were around, so this would be an awful place for a talk. It turned into a huge catastrophe if I were to talk about my love life in this storm filled with young women. Went ahead of my room then. It was easy to invite Reyna since she'd been over at my place a number of times before and would likely know the best way to approach the matter at hand. Ah, yes! I thought he was going to go to freaking Rhea. Finally, bless Rhea. Because Rhea was literally in every group, like any problem, specifically girl problem, Rhea was always there. Always. So it's nice to see a switch. I had no objection would come into her for advice. I mean, he's gone to her. <laughs> Reyna? But, but, it was in her own route. Or maybe there were a few incidents in the common route in the other game, but definitely not like with Rhea. Huh? Haven't you eaten already? Different stomach? Man, you scarfed down so much yesterday too. Don't blame me if you put on weight. I offered her my cherished potato chips and chocolate. Small price to pay if I meant she'd give me advice. Well, eat however you like. Itadaki. So, but what I wanted to talk about. To tell you the truth, something's been on my mind lately. Are you listening? Is this really going to be alright? I'm gonna keep going then. I'm wondering how I should win over a girl's heart. But much? Yeah, I guess so. Sorry. Hang on, nobody's even talking about Mina chan. Uh, well, no. Where? Huh? That did help given how it all turned out. In fact, I'm grateful. I did? She's funny. Reyna had seen through me completely. Doing a half-hearted job hiding it now would be pointless. You nailed it. I want your advice so I can win Mina-chan over. Isn't she a girl first and princess second? It is? It is? If only I could be this way in front of her. I'm self-conscious of everything now, though. Shut up. Don't start up on that. Huh? さいごに勝つのは可愛いだから。可愛いは正義。それと夢だね。恋愛は恋と夢で作るもんだ。オッケー。いい女の子はね、とにかく夢を見たいもんなの。神にゃんは王女様になってあげなきゃ。A okay. prince. Huh?何?不満?No, it's not like that. Being a princess herself, I'd imagine she's met plenty of princesses. 
Wouldn't that mean I'd have zero chance of being able to compete against them? Huh? Sorry, it's not clicking. <coughs> my throat is burning. Oh my god. It is the spicy stuff, my mom. Oh god. <coughs> if I don't upload another video after this one, I probably died. Just letting y'all know. No, I'm kidding. At this point in my life, I'm immune to it. Kind of. Not really. <laughs> Special treatment. Well, excuse me. Uh, please teach me, Master. <laughs> that was the moment my new master was born. Oh, God. Golden <laughs> Time. <laughs> Hey, Sylvie, do you have a minute? I had more or less gotten a general grasp of how to treat girls things of Raina's advice. But I really wanted to see what she was going to tell him. He just skipped over it. Kind of whack. There's something I'd like to ask you real quick. I want to know what real princess are like. In addition to Raina's advice, I still wanted to learn how a genuine princess were. That led me to the conclusion that it would be best to ask Sylvie. I figured I could use their demeanor for my own reference. <laughs> hmm? No, I don't think so. Huh? Really? I'm smiling, I'm smirking like a moron because this is the first time in a while where she's not being a Karen-chan. Nah, maybe Nag-chan fits her better because it is kind of like Karen-like behavior, but it's more naggy than anything, you know what I mean? Yeah, Nag-chan works better. I'm sure they have. Well, why would you bring Mina-chan up? They saw it through me that fast. Bro, they know you already confessed to her. Like, why is that a surprise? That they won't work as references? Probably not. でしょ。大事なのは外側じゃないと思うの。ですね。一松殿には諸国の王子にない魅力がありますから。そういうこと。オールはオールなりの王子様を目指せばいいと思うわ。That's some solid advice. This is making less sense by the second. Except this moron still doesn't understand, clearly. But I do want to act cool to some degree. I wouldn't show off to the girl I liked and for her to think I was cool in return. Those sentiments and that state of mind seemed important. Minachan had taught me so many things. Shouldn't I show her how much I've grown? Mm -hmm. No, you don't have to go that far. It don't make me nervous. Of course it would. A legit dinner party with royalty would be too much all at once. I couldn't help but wonder what Sylvie considered small, and if that required dealing with the entire country. I'll accept the sentiment, at least. Thank you. So that was your real motive? Wait, 
Where are you going? Okay. She headed off to a corner of the classroom with other son. I could tell that other son was sighing deeply but couldn't make out the final details. What were you talking about? Alright. Oh. The timer just went off. I knew I shouldn't, but I couldn't help but sigh. I'd never experienced these sort of feelings before. Where I could find the answer and what form it would take, I had practically no idea. Why was One Sama here? No, I didn't invite her in before I worried about why. ごめんなさいね、突然。いえ、お姉様ならいつでも歓迎ですけれど、どうしてここに。え、エルに無理を言ってきちゃった。宿に申し訳ありません。ですが、私も神なる様のことが心配でしたので。心配ですのだって大切
Hug from Onesama. How long had it been? Did I also have him to think for this? The gift. Interesting. Now that's a good spot. Oh, I went 10 minutes. Oh, oh no, 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 we're good. We're good. We're gonna leave it at the triple dot. Or should we? Nah. I hadn't gotten to have a real conversation with Minachan for the last few days. During our daily etiquette lectures, she'd give me a brief overview of the topic before immediately leaving. From what I could tell, these recent sessions worked out in less than half an hour. So he's been taking off quickly lately, too. I was hopeless and at an absolute loss of how Mina Chan was doing. Ah, <sighs> what should I do? I wish they would include this dude a lot more in the group. The one guy that talks to him often and he's just not included like that. Like, that's kind of whack. I think he's cool. I like him. But, anyways, wrapping it up right there. I like where this is going. Like I said earlier, I was surprised to see that Mina didn't know how to respond even then, which is good because now I'm like, huh, I wonder how this is gonna end. I can't wait to see how it ends. It's been very interesting, though I'm surprised, I've said it before, I'm gonna say it again. I'm surprised that there wasn't a Mina-chan in the first game. Like they had to make a second game for Mina to get a root if Mina was the one that was spending the most time with Odo too, out of all the maidens. So it doesn't make much sense to me. You'd think, that she would get a root, but barely now, <laughs> you know? But anyways, with that being said, I'm gonna wrap it up there. Thank you so much for watching this episode. And if you did enjoy it, please hit that like. Subscribe if you haven't already done so. Let's hit a thousand subscribers. We're so close, but so far away. Anyways, I'm out of here. I'll let y'all go. Y'all stay safe and as always, until next time.